For the first time in nearly a decade, the state of Tennessee is set to execute a convicted killer by lethal injection. Thanks for joining us, everyone. I'm Katina Rankin. And I'm Richard Ransom. Child murderer and rapist Billy Ray Irick will be put to death at 7 tonight. But some people are trying to stop that execution. Local 24's Mary Jo Ola is live in Midtown, where a protest is set to get underway tonight. Mary Jo. Yeah, Katina and Richard, people against the death penalty are planning to hold a vigil on the steps of Cooper Young's First Congregational Church right here behind me. We did get an update earlier today from the state that said Billy Ray Irick received his final meal at 3 o'clock and he had requested a burger, onion rings, and a Pepsi. Now, Irick was convicted in 1986 for the rape and murder of a 7-year-old girl in Knox County. His case was tied up in court for three decades. Now, organizers for tonight's vigil are criticizing the drug that will be used, arguing it's tied to problematic executions and will increase the chance of complications. They also believe that the death penalty system in Tennessee is broken and unfairly applied. Now, Katina and Richard, as you mentioned, Irik is set to be executed at 7 o'clock tonight. Those protesters are expected to meet here at 6. So coming up on Local 24 News at 6, we will have a live report as that vigil gets underway. Reporting live in Midtown Memphis, Mary Joola, Local 24 News.